Hey guys, we're going to go over our golf stance thoracic rotation with a liftoff using a dowel. Now, unfortunately for this one, you won't be able to use your driver. Um, it's not long enough. Chances are even a broomstick won't be long enough. So for this drill, you're going to have to go to a home hardware or something and pick up a longer dowel, or you can pick up a DaVinci stick uh, online. Okay, so what I'm going to have you do is place the, the dowel in front of you, get into a golf stance, nice and balanced. Now I'm a lefty, so I'm actually going to flare out my right foot. That's totally fine. I want to have you grab your dowel with your golf grip. And for starters, let's just start about face level, okay? Now I can do this up here, but when I go into my rotation, I'm going to be blocking my mic. So I'm going to try and stay about here, and hopefully I won't block it too much. Okay, so from here, I'm balanced. All I want you to do is let the dowel fall to your left. Okay, keeping your golf stance. And notice how this shoulder is externally rotating. Okay, just like we kind of want, most of us want, in our golf swing. Now, Jack Nicholas, he had a flying elbow, but he was able to shallow the club, whereas many of the amateurs, including myself, have a difficult time shallowing the club if your elbow is out here. Much better time doing it if you can actually get your elbow in this position. Okay, so. <clears throat> Golf stance, balanced, externally rotating, and letting the dowel fall to my left as far as I can go with a good stretch. Okay, maintain my posture. From here, I like to actually take a breath or two, a real big deep breath into the belly. Exhale twice as long. And just kind of feel that stretch a little bit more. Okay, so from here, what I want you to do is get nice and tight now. Squeeze the heck out of the dowel. Squeeze your core. Squeeze your glutes, and without losing posture, try to pull the dowel off the ground just like a half inch or so, and hold for a two count. One, two, and then back down, okay? As you can tell, this is not gonna be easy. Big breath, without losing posture. One, two, and back down, okay? Now this, I've done it with hips square to the camera. Once you get good at that, you can also try doing it just as if you were in a golf swing. So I'm balanced, I'm stretching right now. Just as you would in your golf swing, you'd rotate your back, your left hip in my case. If you're a righty, your right hip, okay? And now you can actually get a little bit more of a stretch. Now, because of my hand placement, I'm, I'm, you can see I'm kind of leaning forward. This wouldn't be ideal for me. So I'm gonna actually go back up a little bit higher into my golf grip. All to the left. Okay, now I'm in a good stretch. Hopefully I'm not blocking the mic too much. Get that hip rotation and get a little bit further. Okay, same thing from here. Get nice and tight and try to lift off without losing posture. One, two, and back down. That's a tough one, guys. Obviously you want to do both sides. This is your golf stance, thoracic rotation with a liftoff using a dowel.